Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nog. Welcome along to Soccer Ban, the RPG episode number six. Last off, we just finished with that puzzle. <coughs> oh dear God. Uh, really? All right, so basically, I get the idea. Of this you just got to kind of like move things around so that you're kind of like moving the space around. It's like one of those, um, one of those like finger puzzle things. You have like a space in, you got to like move the tiles around to get that. That's what I'm kind of like imagining at the moment. So, I mean, I kind of want to get. I'm going to want to get in the middle somehow. And by the middle, I mean like the bottom half, not like the top half. Other than that, we'll be, you should be able to then manipulate it in some way, shape, or form. The easiest thing to do would be that. Then how would I move? All right, this one. <coughs> Excuse me. This one's um, possibly going to take a bit of brain power. completely thrown things out though. Into a sense that we can't even... We can't even do anything now. That's how much I've screwed that one up. Uh, okay, so... I've done that now in a way that I can't actually move anything anymore on the board. The thing is though, I can't push them out to the outside because there's nowhere I can actually get round. Like all the way around. So it, for instance, if I push that one if I say push this one here, I can then only move it to here. I can move it down as far as here, but then I can't get around it. 
and I can't do anything else with it. And I can't put it back. Um, you know, it's not like I can even take it all the way around the, the shape. Although I could do it here. There is room here. It's interesting. Oh, but the only way that would work is... So that's only good for the ones at the top, right? And the only way that would work... Oh, hold on. Am I massively... I think I'm massively overcomplicating this. I may be completely wrong, but... If I was to do this... Push that one up to there... Wow. Yeah, I massively overcomplicated that one. But yeah, that was, that was pretty tough to see though. Um, obviously you've got to look at them and until I properly looked at the surroundings and saw this sort of like 2 by 2 area here that I could actually use something on the outside of that. Um, it certainly made things interesting. So initially looking here we can see that this block can only go this way which means this one can go up to there I can push that one across I can't push it any more than that I need to get in at the back. I do that. Let's push it down, not across. This one then goes over here. And then we go just around and about with these two. Excellent. Okay, what we got here? Uh, this one's going to have to go all the way to the right. push that down though I can't then get into this other area and I can't push anything else to that side which is problematic likewise now I've done that okay so the one in the top has to go to right can't go left can't go down has to go right and then come down one then it's pushed across Top one moved. I still.
still think it has to go like that. Let's leave that one there for now. But... I mean, yeah, that's great. I, then I can manipulate these. And still have the same issue, though. So that would have to... Then I can move that one, and I can just keep repeating that pattern over and over again. Alright, so. That's why I didn't want to do that. All right, but I think that's... It's effectively what we want to achieve, right? No, 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 no. Undo that move. Undo that move, please. All right. I think they all need to be in a line there. Let's not commit any of the. They need to all be in a line here. I think. No. 
Yeah, I need to put it here. Then I can still move it from there, right? I think. needs to go. Maybe. Whether it's the first one or the second one. Second one. Actually, I can give myself the space early on by pushing that one across first. Can't get back, so no, that's not... Surely. Because now I don't have access to get to the bottom of that to push anything up. I have completely butchered this. Big time. <sighs> okay. This has to be the first move. It can go there for now. Then we have to remove this. So if I push this across... I can get out here. And I can push this one across here. And do that. Maybe leave that one there, but then I'm no, I'm in the same position as I was before. Because that could be actually do the middle ones first, push the next one across as far as there, go all the way around, push it down and across, and repeat that twice. All right, that is. I'm convinced that's what I need to do. So do the middle ones first, upper ones first, upper, middle, tomato, tomato, yeah. All right, so. And I need to move this one. So I can then move that one over to there. 
This one travels over here. Yeah, but that doesn't help. I should have left it... I don't know, actually. Oh, I was convinced that was right. shouldn't matter about that one at the minute, actually, because I can still work my way around stuff until I get to there. Not a big problem. Is it? I will get this. I will get this. I'm not going to end this episode until I do. I'm determined. Not moves like that, that or not. So, that back up. In the meantime, I put that one there. Oh, I may have just messed up. Yes, I have messed up. What point do I mess up that? It's not right, because now I can't push them up. And that was my whole point. That I needed to do the middle ones first, so I can push them up and then drop the second ones in. Well, I'm going to contradict myself. I'm not going to finish this episode. So make sure you come back, guys, for the next episode, uh, episode number seven, where hopefully we'll get the better of this puzzle and complete it and continue on our journey. But until next time, I've been Nock, you've been awesome. See ya.